US musical theatre giant Stephen Sondheim, the composer and lyricist behind Broadway hits like West Side Story, has died aged 91. His eight lifetime Tony Awards surpassed the total of any other composer. Stephen Sondheim was one of musical theatre's most prolific and successful writers, winning eight Tony Awards, eight Grammy Awards, an Academy Award, a Pulitzer Prize for Drama, and in 2015, the Presidential Medal of Freedom. Sondheim was born on March 22, 1930, in New York City. His parents divorced in 1942, and he moved to Pennsylvania with his mother. In Pennsylvania, he became friends with James Hammerstein, the son of lyricist Oscar Hammerstein. Throughout his teen years, his relationship with his mother deteriorated, and eventually the two became estranged. But Oscar Hammerstein was a constant figure, encouraging Sondheim's musical talents throughout high school and college. If it hadn't been for the Hammersteins, I really don't know where I would be if I'd even be alive. Everything free. In America. Sondheim's big break came when he wrote the lyrics for the Broadway show West Side Story in 1957. Then in 1962, he expanded his repertoire and for the first time he wrote the lyrics and composed the music for A Funny Thing Happened on the Way to the Forum. In 1970, Sondheim began a collaboration with theater producer Hal Prince that lasted more than a decade. Their 1973 play, A Little Night Music, was composed mostly in waltz time and became one of their biggest commercial successes. It featured the hit, Send in the Clowns, one of Sondheim's best known songs. You here at last on the ground. In 1979, Sondheim wrote what was probably Broadway's first musical thriller, Sweeney Todd the story of an English barber and serial killer. See this sunshine, how he smiles. What's great about the theater is it's a living organism, whereas movies and television are as if in amber. It's not that they're dead, but they're only alive in one shape, form, and tone. Every time you see a movie, they're giving the same performances they did the last time you saw them. Not true of a show. Inspiration was everywhere for Sondheim. And in 1984, moved by a famous painting by Georges Seurat, he penned the lyrics for Sunday in the Park with George. For that inventive stagecraft, he won the Pulitzer Prize for Drama. In 1987, he wrote the Broadway hit Into the Woods, based on the fables of the Brothers Grimm. Now before it's past midnight. Late in Sondheim's career, Lin-Manuel Miranda approached him with something he was working on, a musical then called The Hamilton Mixtape. Sondheim mentored Miranda just as Hammerstein had done for him. From waltzes to rap, Inspired by everything from serial killers to fairy tales, Sondheim's impact on American musical theater spanned decades and created some of the world's most popular musicals. 